Once you have purchased the Team Viewer add-on from your IBM sales rep, you will receive a welcome email with the details on how to activate the integration and various other useful information. Log in to your IBM MASS360 instance. Go to Setup, Services, and scroll down to Remote Support for Mobile Devices and Laptops slash Desktops. Log in with the TeamViewer account included in the welcome email or email IBM Mass360 support. And that's at IBM Mass360 support at teamviewer.com to request the provisioning of a new account. The TeamViewer integration is now activated and you can start using the remote connectivity features. TeamViewer integration to IBM Mass360 supports attended access for all the main operating systems including Windows, Mac, Android, iOS, and Windows Phone 10. This functionality enables administrators to connect to employees' devices to diagnose and troubleshoot any issues while ensuring the device is secure and corporate data is not compromised. When you want to remotely connect to a device, go to Device Inventory and select the device you want to connect to. You can see the option to initiate remote support directly from the list view by clicking More and then initiate remote support. Or from the device detailed view again through more options and initiate remote support. Once you select the initiate remote support option, a pop-up will be shown with the details of the created session. By clicking the administrator link, the TeamViewer desktop client will be launched and the admin will enter the remote control session. In parallel, a notification will be shown on the end user side with the secure invitation. Once that person clicks the notification, the pre-deployed TeamViewer quick support app will be launched and a pop-up will be shown asking the user to accept the incoming connection. Then the connection is established and the administrator can remotely control the device. The TeamViewer integration on IBM Mass360 also supports unattended access for Android devices. This includes devices in kiosk mode, like point of sale and digital signage devices. This feature allows admins to take over devices that don't have someone working on them directly for example, during out-of-office hours or dedicated corporate devices. You can find the option to initiate a remote control session in the same way. If the required TeamViewer application, called TeamViewer Host, has been deployed on the target device, the unattended option will be automatically shown. Select Unattended Access, and on the following screen, click the link that is shown. The connection is now established and the admin can investigate any issues and ensure the device is ready for use.